Hey there, Randall Schwartz back again with another uh, quick tip of things that I have discovered right along with y'all. Trying to figure out how to make things work. Boy, I tell you that uh, Flutter, uh, Flutter Explode, Flutter something. <laughs> Flutter, the big Flutter event a couple days ago. Awesome. Uh, just overwhelmed with everything. But now I said, now that uh, Dart 2.12 is now stable, uh, time to start your migration. And I've seen three or four screencasts on migration, but nobody ever talked about the point that I'm about to talk about. Or if they did, they just did hand-waving. You might have noticed that almost everybody said, in big letters, big bold letters, you must migrate your libraries before you migrate your code. So make sure your libraries are migrated or make sure there's already a, a, a null safe uh, version of that. So I want to show what happens when you don't do that. And you can still move forward. Check this out. just requires a little extra typing. So I have two uh, directories here. I have underneath my migrate play directory, I have my lib and my bin. So my lib is going to be legacy. So we're going in here my lib of course the environment the key thing here is we're saying this thing runs with 2.10 I don't have any fancy new features in here don't have any of the 2.12 features in there so this thing runs with the legacy already existing as of at least a six week or six months ago nothing new yet okay and so uh, this is what you get when you do flutter create um, type library type package something like that uh, actually not flutter create dart dart create <laughs> and by the way that's the new command in place of stagehand get rid of stagehand start using the new dart create that's going to be a lot more fun okay um, so 2.10 that's happy now let's look at the other things that got generated automatically by uh, the old stage and the new dart create uh, we've got the library the library is not terribly exciting here uh, all this is stock I didn't change a single thing here but remember back in the pub spec we are running under 2.10 or later which means it will go into legacy mode for this now this code gets brought in and this is where the good parts are this is our uh, class awesome. This will be familiar to anybody who's done this with stage and or the new dark create command. All it does is you can create an instance of it of awesome and then you can call dot is awesome on it and that is a member variable uh, in the form of a get and it returns true. Nothing exciting there yet. Okay. Now, uh, it also generates a my live example dot dart which basically pulls in the library that I've just created uh, creates an awesome object uh, and uh, calls uh, is awesome on that, which gives it uh, the uh, it'll, it'll come back true. Okay, and so let's go ahead and run that. Uh, I'm in my lab here, so let's go Dart example um, my lab example on Dart. Okay, awesome colon true. Nothing surprising yet. This is legacy code being invoked by a legacy uh, executable. Nothing surprising. Let's start getting interesting here. So in my bin, I went in. Let me make sure I've got the room correctly down here. There we go. Um, I went in and I created. Nope, I updated. There it is. I said, this is not a legacy app. This is a sound null safety app. And uh, follows all of the sound null safety rules. I also have used, and hopefully most of you have seen this already, I'm actually using a dependency that's not in pub. The dependency is right here on my disk next to the other one. Up one and over one, right? Up one and down one. So, um... So that just says I'm going to be using that legacy library. Now let's go into my bin dart, also created for me, but I added some stuff to it. And first thing you'll see is that, oh, look at all that. So we have uh, the question mark, the late int, all that stuff is all uh, 2.12 or higher. 
So this is definitely a 2.12 app uh, at this point. Now, there's might be seeing something interesting here, though. See how this says this package is legacy? I think you need to see the whole message here. It's under problems. The library package is uh, legacy and should not be imported into a null safe library. Try migrating the other thing. But let's say that other thing is huge or it's in pub and I don't own it. Can I still use it? Well, it takes a little bit of extra work. So let's go back to my terminal. Okay, I'm in bin. I can say dart uh, bin slash my bin dart. Okay, ignore the my bin xy. We're going to get to that in a minute. And guess what happens? Uh-oh. Dun, dun, dun. It says cannot run with sound null safety because I am depending on my lib, which is legacy still. Huh. So some of you may have stumbled into this even as recently as uh, playing with 2.12, playing with uh, migrating to sound null uh, safety, and you run into this problem. Okay. Now, again, let's say I can't change my live. It wants to run with 2.10 strategies. I need to be able to still use it in my library. Well, I can do that, but I, at the cost of all my null safety compile time going out the window, Instead, all the null safety checks will be done at runtime, but that's no worse than it was before we got uh, sound null safety. It's exactly the same as before. It is still checking for nulls. It's not as efficient. All the new features that, uh, if you watch the uh, video for Flutter, uh, watch the, uh, the, the conference for Flutter, Flutter Engage, I think that was it. There we go. Uh, I'm getting old. Anyway. So, can I do anything with this 2.12 program sucking in this 2.10 library? I certainly can. Let me again invoke that same Dart command that I just had. Dart. No sound. No safety. Bin. My bin. Dart. There it goes. There it goes. Look at that. So what we've done is we've disabled the sound null safety. And at that point, it says, Oh, you're cool. We understand that you have a 2.12 bin that's loading in a legacy 2.10 library. And that works. And it even works making exes. In other words, making a compiled app, but you still got to put this in here. This is why I thought it went here after Dart run, but nope. Dart compile exe. No sound, null safety. This is the right order. And we hit return. And there was the thing to notice. We are compiling this without sound, null safety. So yes, I got my exe file here but it is not sound null safety. It's the same null safety we had prior to this, the legacy stuff. And can I run that? Let's see. My bin exe? Yes, still runs the same way. The four comes from this setup. The uh, um, X is, uh, so X is four, print X. There we go, sorry, all three lines there with a wait and hello world. And then this is calling into that library that is legacy, but it all works. So you don't have to fear migrating your package. It's just that if you execute it, you might need to add no sound null safety when you're launching your uh, bins. And I think that same switch also shows up in Flutter for Flutter Run. So um, enjoy. Uh, you know, click all the things you're supposed to click and thumbs up and subscribe and all that sort of things and tell people about this because this is going to catch people up because this was not demonstrated in any other video yet all right until next time enjoy